Hi, this is Keith and Brian again. We're going to be introducing and just do a quick uh, run over of the LTKSD 2.0. As you can see, we've got a new protective case for it. This particular one is our complete, which is the KW1 keyway already attached to a tool, as well as the SC1 keyway already attached to a tool. Of course, it's got the charger which, as you can see, improvement there is the USB-C charger instead of the old style. Um, they both have their respective cards as well as their spacers. And as you can see, the quick set one. So I'm gonna take this out here real quick, set this aside. and go over some of the new features of the 2.0. Uh, main thing, or some of the main things are going to be improved phone compatibility if some of you people have had issues with the tool uh, being compatible with your particular phone. Should hopefully see some improvements there. We now have an on-screen battery level indicator as well as the time remaining which is pretty nice. Um, overall it's a new app and it's improved app in our opinion so you won't be using the Mac C app anymore. Uh, the simplify, it's, it's got a simplified Wi-Fi connection process compared to before. And the battery charging light now turns from red when it's charging to green when it's fully charged. And let's go ahead and turn the phone on. Alright, so here's your old Max C app. That's going to be for the original. And the Max View app is going to be for the 2.0. So, normally, what you would, well, we're not going to go over normally because y'all already know how to use the first one. So, now, the way you use the tool is you're going to have it powered up. It's going to light up. LED should be on at that point. And then you're just going to go straight to the Max View app. And then, You've got, on this screen, you've got connected devices, which it's not lit up right now, so there's no devices connected to it. You've got frequently asked questions, and then you've got a little small tutorial. Down here, you've got your remaining power and your time remaining. Of course, this doesn't show anything right now because it's not con hooked up to the tool yet. So we're going to go hit connected devices, and this is going to take us to our Wi-Fi which is going to show our available Wi-Fi. Again, the name of the tool is now going to be a Max View, not a Max C. So we'll go ahead and click our tool. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and go back to the thing. See, now it's connected and this is now blue and we have 90 percent power and 81 minutes remaining alright so now we're gonna go ahead and click this to go into our camera view now it always comes up in landscape view so the first thing you're gonna to want to do when this pops up is go ahead and hit this landscape view up here and that'll rotate the screen around to normal viewing so you still have your camera and your video and your uh, gallery to look at your pictures and videos. This button right here will reverse the image. You don't really want to do that. Um, just confuses things, so probably no reason to mess with that. It's got a lock button up here to work, so you won't be messing with the buttons. This is your brightness dial now. There's also brightness dial right here on the back of the tool, which will dim it. You also have a zoom in, zoom out, and you can still take the pictures from the camera, just from the back of it, if you don't want to do it from the screen. So, not going to decode a lock right now, it's not really the point of the video, but just wanted to show you
All right. So there we go. Uh, that's our 2.0.